driving down to Kentucky. I'm in Ohio, about 250 miles away to get a truck bed shell, like a camper shell for the back of my truck. I've been looking for one for so long. You know, they were $2,500, $3,000, and I wasn't paying that. And there's a guy down there that's got one for my exact make and model, a short bed Ram, and he only wants 600 for it. So I'm going to get it. That way I could, you know, start the project I've been wanting to do on that. I've been wanting to do is like a portable camper for the bed of my truck and I got a video on my channel where I you know was trying to do that and I just went a whole different way with it and it didn't really turn out all the way how I would have wanted it to so here's sort of like a, a second go of that but you know uh, it's going to be a more cleaner way of doing it everything went smooth what had happened was you know at first I thought he was just oh you know I got other people coming uh, so you better hurry up what happened was he had two of them he had one for a longer bed like the what is a 6'2 or 6'4 ram bed and then he had one for the 5 foot 7 ram bed nobody came for that one so I was I was the only person there for that one so it was all cool I lucked out because everybody was in there fighting over the, the longer one. So I guess it's some, some perks to get the short bed truck. It was like a dealership that I guess didn't want them or didn't need them or something like that. When they get trade-ins, I guess they don't sell them with the trucks. They sell them separate or whatever. So, so I mean, I guess that's why there was a whole bunch of people trying to go get them. First, I was going to try to order one of these maybe a year ago, year and a half ago. It was during COVID time, so they were about a year out on production and you know two thousand to twenty five hundred three grand you know i just picked this up for 600 bucks i lucked out yeah Right. I gotta clean it out. Yeah, it even came with a carpet, so I'm gonna end up taking this rubber mat out. I gotta get it wired up, so I'll be doing that. Here in a minute, I'm gonna run the Ikea. It's smaller than a twin. It's a twin size, but it's shorter. This is only five foot seven in here. The, 
the twin that's shorter is only five foot five maybe five foot six something like that so it's just gonna be just enough room to where it can close and everything and I might as well do one of these to go ahead and clean it there now I just gotta rinse it down a little bit and be good to go it's getting dark but there now it's clean clean carpet liners in that's gonna pretty much wrap it up today stay tuned for the next one